Hey guys, Diana here from Garden Love and Lily here from Garden Love. We're here to show you guys this amazing, amazing thing. My low quad finally set fruit. You guys know last year it flowered for the very first time after about four years that I've had it. Uh, I almost gave this tree away because I, it was a seedling that I found out there last year and I was very disappointed because I thought it was grafted and um, I didn't think it was going to produce for years to come. I've been taking care of this baby since the minute I got it and I've been giving it compost, fertil uh, fertilizing it once a month. I've been giving it um, warm tea and fish uh, fertilizer. So I have been doing everything I can to grow this tree because you guys know, for those of you who have been following me for a long time, that loquats is one of my favorite fruits and I am just super thrilled to actually be able to grow it in my own backyard and have my very own tree. I'm hoping that uh, I'm very pleased with the production that it gave me this year and I'm, very, I'm hoping that next year will give me even more. I'm going to give it a huge trimming once I harvest all the fruit. And I should be harvesting this pretty soon because I don't want the birds to get to it. And I, I know a lot of you guys mentioned that you guys aren't familiar with a loquat. I want to show you what it looks like. It's kind of furry. If you rub it off, it gets shiny. It has where the flowers started. And that's what it looks like. And I did bring, I thought I brought some water. Oh, there's the water. Let me get some water because I want to show you guys what it looks like inside and unfortunately today is a little cloudy it's a little chilly that's why I have my jacket on but I brought some water so I can rinse it because I want to taste this I've been waiting to taste this and by the way this is a gold nugget gold nuggets are very um, common to be grown from seed now this is what I usually do I usually just peel the skin off see that just peel it off you don't need the skin I throw it away and then I just do that Lily can you help Chesty stop so he can stop doing that he's trying to grab a stick or a lizard come here Chesty come here I know he can get annoying in some of my videos I apologize about that just a happy dog so there guys look it's completely peeled see that now I'm gonna take a bite out of this and I'm gonna show you what it looks like inside mm. it's not as sweet as most but it definitely is sweet do not eat these seeds I'm gonna be saving these if you guys are interested um, I can send you guys a few Mmm, so good. So, so, so good. Now there's some um, the membrane that holds the seeds. I don't eat that. How could you give me another chip? You want to want to try one? No, could you give me another chip? Oh, okay. Mmm, so good, guys. Chesty. And let me show you guys what the membrane looks like right there. See that? Just take it off. And then just eat the rest. I'm so happy. And as you can see, it had four seeds. Sometimes it has three, sometimes I've had one when it had one human, one huge one. So I'm going to be saving these seeds and hopefully starting some from seeds and giving them away and maybe shipping some. I'm very curious to know if Lead Farmer 73 also got a production. His is in the ground, mine is in a container. I'm very limited in space and I'm trying to maximize my space by growing things in containers. I'm hoping that some of you guys who don't believe have a lot of space can take a look at this and see that it is there's definitely space you just have to work with your what you're working with anyways guys i'm just so excited to share this with you guys let me wash my hands and let me give you guys a close look of what the tree looks like so there's the fruit 
And there is the container. As you can see, it's in a wine barrel. It's in a wine barrel. It used to be in a pot similar to that one. And now it's in a wine barrel. And as you can see, there's fruit here. And let's go over here because I noticed some awesome fruit back here. Look at that. Oh, the air layer is still there. The branch right above it is still going. So I don't know if it's producing any roots. Let's take a look at that while we're at it. I don't see any roots. There's still moisture in there, so that's a good thing. That's it, guys. I'm so excited to have this fruit here. And I wanted to share with you guys, I'm so happy that I was able to taste my very first one. I am very satisfied. Honestly, any loquat for me, no matter how sour or sweet they are, I absolutely love them. And... They're great for your stomach. They're great for your digestive system. Just try one. If you drive by one, they're usually all over the place. Um, just try one. I encourage you to try one. If you're growing one, let me know. I love to hear about how old they are, how much they're producing, and whether they're in a container or they're in the ground. So leave it down in the comments down below. Lead Farmer 73, I hope you're seeing this and I'm hoping that you are getting the same results and that I see a video from you pretty soon. All right, guys, Diana here from Garden Love. I look forward to seeing you guys in the next one. Love you. Bye. Well, look at how the cup's Are you still recording?